All right. So we have a locus, and we um, know that the energy output of jumping muscles is proportional to body mass m. And um, now, in in humans, there's a much more variance in this than there is in the animal kingdom. Um, well, actually, my cats are pretty fat too. But um, the the jumping muscles are proportional to body mass m. The gravitational potential energy gained at height h is mgh. So if we have a, a, a 0.2961 gram locus can jump to this height, how, can, how high can an 80 kilo human jump in centimeters, right? Well, the energy, here's what we know. The kinetic energy is, is that it? Yes, is proportional to m. And we know that at the end of the day, the kinetic energy equals the kinetic energy you have when you um, take off is equal to mgh. And gravity is the same for the grasshopper and the human. And that means in these terms that um, since kinetic energy is proportional to m, I can rewrite it as some factor. We don't know beta m equals mgh. Um, it turns out the, the, the mass doesn't matter, right? And, and so whatever H is, H is, right? And so the mass cancels out. We're left with beta, which is the same for all creatures over G is H. Well, beta is the same for everyone. G is the same for everyone. So every animal grasshopper insect everything can jump to about the same height all right about the same height now again in some mammals there's much more variance um because we have uh, we have ex excess fat that we carry around right so some mammals much more variance than in other parts of the the um animal kingdom so there you go. Um, it's a really easy problem.